Bonjour, mon amigo. Uh, I'm not here to rant, even though I love this. Drinking with Bob, awesome. Um, I wish I could rant sometime. Before I was on YouTube, I was sending email newsletters to people about things that concerned me. I didn't get many responses. Uh, yesterday I got a video from a sent to me thank you from several people from Volano regarding the rights of Christians and the new uh, youth core. I have some more news about that I found out today. And it made me think about something that I sent out when I used to write my newsletter, The Real Deal. That very few responses, but I was trying. Um, in Oxford, England, there was an article that I sent out to everyone about council set to axe Christmas. There was a plan to axe the word Christmas from last year's city center festival celebration. It was criticized by religious leaders. You won't believe this. Council chiefs confirmed there will be no traditional Christmas light switch on in Oxford, England, famous for its gorgeous Christmas light displays. Instead, revelers will be greeted with a 25 meter high mobile of lanterns in the shape of the solar system. Oh, sounds like kindergarten. City Council confirmed this year's event would be called the Winter Light Festival, including all religious denominations. Shoppers criticized the decision. There will be no mention of the word Christmas in the reduced festive lights program. This is the brainchild of the charity called Oxford Inspires. I looked it up. Look up Oxford Inspires. I don't know who these people are or if they're really people. They're amazing. The counselors say they're not Christmas killers, but the move has outraged religious leaders of all denominations. Sabir Mirza, this is what got me, chairman of the Muslim Council of Oxford said, I'm really upset about this. This is the one occasion where everyone looks forward to in the year. Christians, Muslims, and other religions all look forward to Christmas. Sabir Hussein Mirza said, this is going to be a disaster. I'm angry and I'm very, very disappointed. Christmas is special and we shouldn't ignore it. Now, Oxford Inspire says this is just to increase participation in cultural events. Christmas is my culture. Is it your culture? All around here, it's all about Christmas. We love Christmas. And it's not anything to dis disregard anyone else. It's my culture. I think this is an important thing for us to look at. Like Fever I Am and other people say, if you look at things that happen in the UK, they happen over here. We cannot allow this. And that's as much of a rant, I guess, as I can get into. The only other thing I have to say is, I'm trying to pick out an apron to wear on April 15th. This one's more colorful. This one's a little more benign. I I'm going to march with an apron. Because I'm American mom. <laughs> Blessings.